Hi there, Leah from the MyCase product team here to show you how to create and send digital intake forms using MyCase. Intake forms are great because they streamline your intake process and also eliminate manual data entry. Here's how they work. To create an intake form, navigate to the settings page. Then click intake forms on the left sidebar and add new intake form. When creating an intake form, you'll be able to add a form name, which the client will see. You can also add a form introduction, which could be the purpose of the form or instructions. And then for form fields, you have the option of contact and case fields, which are mapped fields. And you also have the option to use unmapped fields. For contacts, for mapping fields, you can have some standard fields like name or phone number or you can also map to the custom fields you have created for contacts. Map fields are great because they help remove the need for manual data entry. For example, if you didn't have a contact's address, as well as some other personal information, you could send them an intake form requesting that information. And when the contact fills out the address field and submits the intake form, their address will automatically be added to their contact information in my case. If you wish to see what your form will look like after creating it, go ahead and click the preview form button. Once you're all done creating your form, click save changes. After you've created your form, to send the intake form to a leader contact, find the potential case or case that that contact or lead is linked to. Once in the case details, click the Intake Form subtab. Then click the Add Intake Form. Select the intake form you want to send to the lead. And as you can see, this lead already has an email, so it automatically enters it into the Send To. You can update the subject if you wish and also edit the message. You can choose to save and send the intake form now via my case, which will send the intake form in an email to the lead to fill out. You can also choose to save and send the intake form later, or if you happen to have the lead on the phone, you could select save and fill out the form now for the lead. Once you click save and send, that email will be sent to the lead and the intake form will appear underneath the intake form subtab. When the lead fills out the form and submits it, the status will update to submitted. To view the lead submitted intake form, you can click the intake form name and that will open up a new window with a PDF view of the submitted answers. Any of the map fields will be automatically filled in. For example, you can see the phone number now exists for this lead. And that's how you create and send digital intake forms in my case.